smack a like on it. <laughs> I'll share the link to uh, Lena and Hans. <laughs> oh, thank you. Who? Oh, it's me. I'm, <laughs> I'm our viewer. <laughs> There you go, ready. Right, now just share it to the story. And a late entry. Aussie Feck. Oh. Aussie Feck's already entered, I think. Oh. I think there's a few more. There are friends from Texas has been on here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> right. Okay. Chat Ranger, hi. Oh. Hi, Pat. Okay. Yes? You're on Wikipedia, but you can't like, comment. Hmm? You can right. comment. Yeah. yeah. Please on. We're Dixon in for a while. Dixon Romans. <laughs> <laughs> right. Uh, so strange that one second. John Boost. Hi folks. Hi John. Hello John. Hi. Oh there's Sarah. Hi Sarah. Hi Sarah. Okay, there we go. That's on the story. What's that? That's uh, something on Hutchins Instagram. Oh. What's this? Um, Can you put the... I've oh, just missed it. Yeah, excuse me. What? I'm going to get my iPad so we can look at the comments. I'm not going to get put on the phone. I need your phone to look at uh, any late entries. Ah, I'll go and get it. Oh, oh thanks. Get in, get, you need to go backwards. Where is it? I've got the iPad. It's going to fall. All right. Let's see. Where is it? Get into these. Huh? Where is it? Um, I'm best looking for it to me upstairs. Are you going to leave me with the light? Oh my god. Can you just handle everybody? Right. This is Mia by the way. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Leaving me. A sacrifice for the stream. Love that. Let's see. I can gather all the comments. Um, <laughs> We're rounding up the winners currently. Or I. He's going to disappear and drop a unit. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, they're coming back. Maybe. Oh, phone grumbling. Right, let's some catching up. Oh, yeah. Stand the man. Is it still a broken chair? That's over there. Oh. <laughs> that would have been so funny. Oh, excuse me. Let me just. Uh... Alright, let's see, where were we at? We're at Sarah. Michael Lovett, good evening. Um, Dixie is saying thanks for the brick tongs. Very welcome, Dixie. Mr. Normans. Um, Gareth, Christine, come on, we can hear you. Might as well give her a wave. <laughs> <laughs> um, John Andrews. What's that saying? Christine. Christine, come on, we can hear you, so you may as well come on. <laughs> and Steve Nolik, he's been watching a while now. Great work, thank you very much, Great. Pat. Mum laughing. Great. Jim. Hi folks, how are things? Good, thank you, Jim. Mm -hmm. Pat Link, don't forget to hit the like button. Very much so, thank you, Pat. Uh, Steve says you're so cute, thank you very much. <laughs> uh, Glenn, evening all. Aussie's in, hello, lads and lady. And Somerset Bricky, good evening, lads and lassies. Evening. Good evening. Good evening. So, uh, we've got 42 in at the moment. Have we? Yeah. Well, that's not bad. Assuming we started like a minute, four minutes ago. Mm -hmm. yeah. Can we believe it? Yeah. Hmm? Can we see the yeah. comments? Mm -hmm. That's it. Sandy, evening all. Great to see you again. You are all looking well. Enjoy the weekend. We will. Thank you very much. Going to Birmingham? Oh, definitely, yeah. I'm very excited. So, we've got a few people in at the moment. Michael, hello. Do you watch Charlie Thompson? What do you think? Says Jack. Yeah, uh, well, I don't really watch a lot of. Um, build his YouTube just because I'm busy on Skype with hair all the time. But um, Dad enjoys watching, don't you? What? Charlie. Yeah. Yeah. I enjoy meeting him. Yeah. Oh I yeah. Shook his hand. Yeah. So if you stay in touch with our Instagram, you'll know that Dad is out of shot. 
as it has met Charlie. Put your damn glasses on. I can't see my phone with the glasses I haven't got readers. Oh. Yeah. Um, let's see. Gareth and Lee, hello. Done well for yourself there, Alex. Absolutely, I have. Quite a, uh, a score, if you ask me. Um, can't wait for my free stuff, <laughs> says Gareth. <laughs> <laughs> well, you, you never know. You could be the winner. Uh, Dixie. There you go. Best win winter working weather I've done in 25 years. I've also got Rob Song's phone number. That's my claim to fame. Ozzy, keep your friends nice addition to the channel. Thought I was your dad in a wig at first. <laughs> <laughs> I think we do look quite similar. That is a really na nice comment from a terrible insult to you. <laughs> I'll take it. You look like a fine Swedish girl, Dad. Thank you. <laughs> Mark Hepp is in. Hello, Mark. Hi, Hi Mark. We're at Shirley for you, isn't it? So, we're Look just... Look at your video. Yeah, 3,000 3, 3, views. Still number one. So, we're still getting a bit sorted out at the moment. We've had to rush. We just now finished the uh, table, thanks to Mum. Uh, the other comments are pouring in. Robert, Robert Pemberton. Evening, lads and ladies. Come, uh, come a long way from the videos where you didn't show yourselves. <laughs> it, was, speak. it was Ted's idea to actually get ourselves in. I, would, uh, I wouldn't do it. But um, obviously we've had to adapt and overcome. Uh, oh, Robert's just booked for Alton Towers. Nice one. You've just come back from Alton Towers. Yeah, we picked a good day to go. It's dead quiet. Yeah. Darren Wheeler. Hi, guys. Uh, nice to see you staying safe and well. Thank you very much. Good to see you too, Darren. So, yeah. So, yeah, we're just getting ready now. Getting everything sorted because, as you know, it's the 20K giveaway today. Mm -hmm. We are... that. The way, so, uh, can't talk. the way we're going to do it is a bit different to last time, because if you remember last time... I did it the hard way. We've written everybody's name down on a post-it note. We? I did some. You didn't write anything, they're all over my desk. Yeah, but I wrote some. By you know, hand? Yeah, yes. by hand. And my desk was covered in about 60 post-it oh notes. <laughs> so we've not done it that way this time. What we've done now is I'll give you a quick showcase with the awful quality that it is. We have got everyone's names. Mm -hmm. written down on my notes with a number next to them so we just written them all down give a number and dad on the mac is going to do a number draw a no number randomizer first i've heard mm -hmm. i've just got this one for the comments <laughs> so i can read them so lost my trail of thought now so yeah so we'll draw a random number on the randomizer and then we'll whoever's whoever's lucky name will be on that number will be our winner and then once we've uh, done all that, we'll go into more details of the uh, the giveaway and such. Right. right. Can you just catch up on these comments? I'm catching up, yeah. Um, Bricklayers Worldwide, have I won yet? <laughs> Evening, Andy, not just yet. Did you put um, SNA 20K? I can't remember. Did you put it on? I think he has. Yeah. Uh, not that you Nor need any trowels or any tools there, Andy. <laughs> Dix Norris is asking if we're still making brick, trial, uh, brick tongs. Absolutely not. Made a massive loss on them. What a waste of time they were. But uh, yeah, it took a lot of time and uh, it just it wasn't worth it in the end, was it? No. Uh, Where are we up to? Uh, we're on... Robert's just said hi to Mark. We're on Gareth Hope. I live only a few miles away from him and still don't have Rob's number. <laughs> <laughs> Ozzy, Alex, how did you meet your girlfriend and is she going to be working with you and your dad on future products? Projects. Oh, products. Thank you. I've got my own glasses on. <laughs> um, so we met a long time ago, me and Nia, uh, 2016? Something like it. I think 2016 on Instagram, through uh, our cosplays. That's why I look very bloody, by the way. Yeah, I've not been cosplay today. I've not, done, I've not been fighting today. <laughs> we were we did a cosplay shoot before in the garden, so don't worry, I've not, not fought anyone. But um, so we met through our interesting cosplay and such, and it just kind of grew from there. Yeah. It took a lot of convincing, but I managed to get you get oh, around. Really? Yeah. I managed to <laughs> talk you around eventually. But um, so this is her second time here, and then hopefully in summer I'll be going back. It's starting to feel awkward now. <laughs> <laughs> you talk about get a room. <laughs> talk about when you meet mum with your cars. Um, Matthews Ricardos. Why am I thought Taylor Swift died of her brunette? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Mum says no brick tongs ruined her patio doors. Uh, the patio doors are fixed. Mm -hmm. 
Ozzy and great job on reaching 20k. Thank you very much, Ozzy. Thank you. Dixie. We're actually on 21 and a half now. It's been a while now. Christine was that off the sparks on the grinder. Yes. <laughs> oh, yes, that grinder, says Mum. Uh, Bricklayers worldwide. Dixie knows the tongue's a brilliant get rhino build onto it. That's what that's, that's actually what you're considering, isn't it? Mm -hmm. He's going to try and have a chat with them. Yeah, get a design ready for them. Uh, do, 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 do. He's burnt the doors, <laughs> says uh, Dixie. Ozzy, meant to say project by mistake. Um, so I was right. But mm -hmm. Ben, is that my bird? Yes, it's my girlfriend, Mia. Bird? Bird. That's it, cute. It's a uh, British slang term for girlfriend. Oh, that's cute. I like it. It's a derogatory term for a girlfriend. Oh. <laughs> so, and uh, future projects, yeah. So, Nia's the one who's actually designed these t-shirts. Which, let me turn around. Oh, God, you're going to fall. This is going to be fun. <laughs> Bear with me, everybody. So, don't fall off the chair. So this is our 20k shirt, and mm -hmm. we'll, we'll have one of these in each of the <laughs> prizes. <laughs> one for the uh, Instagram, one for the YouTube, and obviously we're all wearing them to promote them. Yeah, and they're signed too. The winner will receive it. <laughs> She's very adamant that we sign these shirts. Yes. I'm going to go for one extra. <laughs> uh, just value loss. The doors are in, Christine. I fixed them. And so yeah, she's going to be working with us till April now, isn't mm -hmm. it? And maybe help you later. Yeah. So she's going to help us with more designing and stuff. She's like, right now she's working on thumbnails and such. Mm -hmm. We're going to get more like uniform thumbnails and everything. And some yeah, we're going to get some more workwear designed. Maybe merch, maybe, we'll see. See what you think. And uh, just other like, t tidying up our channel basically. Mm. Giving, us, giving us a bit of help. Dominic Hepworth, Blake's or box section. Uh, Blake's mainly, but we'll use it. We'll use box section as a dead man now, now and again. Because we've got all the clumps for the box section, but mainly Blake's. Uh, ja Jacko, where's my girlfriend from? I'm, I'm from Sweden. So, Gothenburg, Sweden. We're actually live from Sweden tonight. Yeah, mm. definitely. Okay. We're, we're coming live from Sweden. All right. Yeah. Oh, you're? Yeah. <laughs> Is Christine being a keyboard warrior? <laughs> so yes. That's Gareth. Yeah, she's going to get an band in a minute. Oh, she's always one of them. A treacle? I don't know. I think she needs a derogatory term. It must be a derogatory term. Um, I think it's caught me around the slang. Let's have a look, see. <laughs> I need to see if I need to uh, have a word with somebody. <laughs> <laughs> treacle. What is it? I never heard it. No. Oh, what? Syrup? No, syrup. I can't be right. Caught me around the slang. Are you supposed to know this? You're English? I'm not Cockney. Oh, ah. that's cute. Thank you. Yeah, okay, yeah. I'll take that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it means who's the lady. <laughs> uh, Jacko asks what a cosplay is. Um, yeah, Minnie's girlfriend. <laughs> oh, hold on a sec. Um, Kiwari, who's the mummers? Oh, mum. Uh, any interesting projects coming up? Not really, is there? Should say that we've got a YouTube channel. Everything's interesting. Yeah. Well, well, there's no big collaborate. Like we've got a big collaboration. There's there's definitely things coming up, but we can't talk about them yet. Through the week, isn't it tomorrow? I oh, know. Twenty eight. Yeah. Three days. Soon. Yeah. Stay tuned in. Stay tuned days. for that. That's gonna be big. And what are cosplays? So cosplays are you basically dress up as video game characters, movie characters. It's like, Anything really. It's fancy dress, but a lot more expensive and intricate. Because, oh, yeah. like, obviously, you could dress up as a kid's Darth Vader, or you could spend a lot of money and actually have the full outfit. Mm -hmm. A lot of craftsmanship as well. Yeah. So, like, the cosplay shoots me and Nia were doing today were from Call of Duty Zombies, mm -hmm. two characters from that franchise. And obviously, you've seen my, if you've seen previous live streams, you've seen my Michael Myers outfit. That's a Michael Myers cosplay. They're, um, and when you cosplay, you're very much trying to immerse yourself into the character as well sometimes. Yeah. You at least. Uh, yeah. Well, yeah. Uh, def so. Definitely as Michael Myers. Mm -hmm. He wouldn't speak to me when he was in that cosplay. So scary. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, let's 
see Stu Glover, 8 mil or 10 mil tuck pointer? 8. 8. Yeah, it's got to go in the joint. If you've got a 10 mil, it's just anything less than 10 mil, it's useless. Daniel Moore, uh, 10, try and cause another word for die. Thank you, Daniel. I just had to make sure, you know, it was a, a good slang word. <laughs> um, uh, ben, she likes it, Alex. Nice one, fair play. Um, how did you meet the young lady? So, through our interesting cosplay on Instagram. And obviously, we've uh, started Skyping from then on. Mm. It was like every now and then, now it's every day. Yeah, can't get rid of me. <laughs> Um, you read, hi guys, congrats on the 20k, well deserved, been watching you from the start, I still enjoy your work, roll on 30k, thank you very much, Red. So it's part of his cosplay outfit. Oh yeah, so when we were in Leamington, I was going to uh, do a Michael Myers uh, thing, but it never came around, so mm. just left it there. Um, Dominic. Site work or domestic? Site work is feeling like Groundhog Day at the minute. So, uh, we we jacked in site work and we've not looked back since. So always. Best thing ever did. Yeah, domestic and private work is definitely our way to go. Site work's just poison. Yeah, especially the site we were on. Which Horrible place to work. We've talked people. about plenty of times. Mm. Not a fan. Yeah, your dad could dress up as R two D two because he's little. <laughs> <laughs> he's got the dome for it too. Yeah. As well. yeah, just slap on some stickers. Um, how old am I, Alex? How old, wait, how old are you, Alex? How old am I? He's lamb meat. That's a slang, a Swedish slang term for a baby, apparently. Mm -hmm. I'm 22. Uh, Red, Steve can go as Uncle Fester. <laughs> <laughs> I can see that. Yeah, that's a good idea, yeah. actually. Bit of um, got makeup under the eyes. Yeah. Definitely. Um, <coughs> laughing. John, oh, <laughs> message has been retracted. Um... Bracus 59 you look good. Oh, that's my dad. <laughs> Hi. Make the near wave to her dad and mom. Hi. Yes, Hans. Yes. You're not in shelter. Uh, I can't sit like that for, for an hour. There you go. <laughs> Hi. Um, Steve, your girlfriend's hot. How did you do that? I ask myself that every day. <laughs> I'm <laughs> um, but um, like as you can tell the contrast. I, I must uh, I must be a good cosplayer. <laughs> um, Dominic still any good money on domestic? Just feels like easier money on site. Oof. I'd rather earn less money to be honest. It, it was site work is very taxing on your bloody well being. Yeah, the whole day is dependent on what kind of mood the thoughtless driver's in. Yeah, and if the uh, site, and if the contract manager decides to kick you all off. Yeah. No, he's a build manager. He was oh, build man. manager. Um, how? Oh, um, you shouldn't, John Andrews. You shouldn't. We do J projects. Um, okay. if you could elaborate on that, please. J projects. Um. How old is your girlfriend? Are you? Do you I'm want, 23. She discloses her age. I didn't like that. Turned 24 this July. Woman. Mm -hmm. was really weird. Have to grow older, sadly. It just happens. <laughs> Daniel Moore, I didn't like the last Halloween film. Felt more like a trailer one before. It was really good. I know what you mean. Yeah, the uh, the this plot for Halloween Kills was kind of a uh, up in the air. It was a bit more about just watching Michael kill, I think. They didn't really think about a script. I was too scared no. to watch. I was watching the movie like this. <laughs> got nauseous. Very bloody. Mm. Very juicy. Oh, yeah. Very ju yeah. Adrian, a bit late. Hi. Hey, Hi, Adrian. Hello, Adrian. Ben, how old are you? Yep, yeah, she's 23. Fire blaster. Oi, oi. Mum, saying hi to Hans and Lena. <laughs> you read new edition puts a sparkle in your eye, Alex. <laughs> Definitely. Pat Cordingly? Am I saying that right? <laughs> How did you find working with your dad? I used to concrete yards and gardens with my dad and hated working with him. <laughs> it's, um, what, are you, you are a shot actually, it's just gap, yeah, I haven't seen you not. No, I've just, I've just moved over slightly. Oh, I see. Um, I enjoy working with him, he's good to work with. Obviously, um, working with my dad, he understands how I am and what I'm like, because I know I'm a handful. On the many different aspects, so he uh, he understands my quirks and handful traits, and obviously um, 
Oh, when one of us is having a bad day, we can uh, always help each other out. Yeah. Give each other the... I'm the having a bad two weeks because he's off for two weeks. I'm all in the lonesome. The father-son hug. But you're in Alton Towers, you were fine. Well, yeah. Ben, you must have something, Alex. Ain't gonna say me. A. Keep it family friendly. <laughs> Tom Buckle, nice work over price work. Yeah. Yes, absolutely. Definitely. Sure. Yeah. That, that's that's like the exact opposite to our site's uh, morals, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. They definitely. Pre- they preferred everything went up and have a wall seventy mil out of plum, which is like Sarah's wall, unfortunately. Um. Hi right, guys. Are you on? Are you on your channel? There you go. Yeah. Hi guys, hope you all had a good week. Hello Steve, thank you very much. Um, ben, Halloween Kills is awesome, Mize is a beast. Goodbye I'm, Jacko. I'm actually uh, working on getting a uh, Halloween Kills Michael cosplay ready. I've uh, got his coveralls, like the old burnt ones up. Yeah. I've got a the Halligan prop he has from um, the, the firehouse scene where he messes up the, uh, the firefighters. Mm. And I've got the mask sent off to get ready to uh, get rehauled, so it's in the, it's in the queue. Goodbye, Jacko. Did he? Yes, he's gone. I see. Uh, Dominic, Steve, did you have any tips for preventing the aches and pains? My back is in bits, and I'm 28. Well, oh, bloody hell. No. What am I like? You're uh, you're well. I'm struggling. I'm 22, and I'm struggling with my knees. Mm-hmm. I should be retired, but I can't. <laughs> um, she's hot stuff. That she is. Ben, fair play, mate. Adrian, did you know you've nearly hit five million views? Oh, yeah, really? We actually have. We got the um, everything's lagged, so YouTube actually contacted us two days ago and said we hit five million. That's great. Yeah. As soon as we get the um, YouTube buddy trophy, I'll put I'll put that up there. Right. Okay. Yeah. Um, she looks good in the top. Yeah, she really ah. suits, she suits the S today. I love the orange. And like like I say, she designed this and she, um, what else have you designed so far? Hmm? Just this so far? Yeah. yeah. Ah. Just this so far. Sorry, do something with DJ Projects. I'd lo- we'd love to do something with DJ Projects, actually. That'd be great, that. I'd love to do a video with them. Because we were going down to see them as well. Mm-hmm. We had a good day with them. I was invited to that one. Yeah, you came to that one. But yeah, so we spent, so while we were down at Leamington, we were with A&E, obviously. We spent, a, Dad spent a... Half a day with Stu, uh, um, not Stu Glover, but the, uh, sorry Stu, <laughs> um, with Charlie Collinson and um, D and J and Rob Songer. More than a five mil, thank you, Sarah. That's the end of the day. Stevie had to run off and leave us. We had to go and help Taff, I think. But be- just before that shot, got right. So. Um, We've got 84 people in, and the comments have uh, we've caught up nearly. Oh, Tall Carpenter's in. All right, Al. Evening, guys. Wanted to do a future garage video wearing a Steve and Alex t-shirt. Where do I get one? <laughs> there we go. Now we got to. Right. <laughs> go get you to work. Go on. Get the shirts designed. <laughs> I'm on it. So, um, we're, we're working on merch. Yes. We'll get, like, we're going to get workwear designed, and then we're going to get merch designed. Yeah. That's what that's what our director's for. She's uh, got the eye for it. Mm-hmm. Um, so should we start make a start with this raffle? Yeah, go on. I'm just spectating, trying to know what's going on. Right. I'll get your foot right. We need a drum roll. How many? Nothing is set up first. Yeah, Eighty-three. Eighty-three. And yep. So we're gonna start the giveaway. So let me just uh, show you so it's fair. Add tab. So Mustafa K. We're based in Lancashire. Number. New Wigan. Hi Gary. Hi Gary's in. Random number generator. So here we go. We've got the random number generator up. Mm-hmm. Are we doing Instagram or YouTube first? We're going to do the Instagram one first. Mm-hmm. Hi Tom, I saw that, that post today. But um, I was at work and um, I had my own work t-shirt on. But yeah. I'm not putting that on shit shit Friday. Right, so Instagram. We have 16 people entered. And I've got 16 jotted in now. Right, we need a drum roll, <coughs> both of you. Okay. Dad, drum roll. No, we're not Mustafa in Manchester. Right, drum roll, generator random number. Hi, Lawrence. Number 12. Peter Kerr. 
Here we go. Uh -huh. So, right, okay. number 12, and number 12 was Peter Kerr, 84. So, uh -huh. congratulations, Peter. Um, you can jot that down somewhere. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, Peter Kerr was our winner. So, congratulations, Peter. You've got, was it a week? We're going to put all these up on our Instagram and YouTube community as well, so we yeah. know, um, we'll know who's where. Um, Lawrence Russell, hope you're well. Thank you, Lawrence. Hello. Ian, welcome back. Haven't forgotten about the strong boys. Pat Link and Gary Ross. Hi, Pat. Hello, everybody. So, should we wait for Dad for the YouTube? Yeah, we'll wait for Dad for the YouTube one. The YouTube one, we've got uh, 75 people entered. It took a long time. It took a long time last night for me and me to oh, yeah. jot all these names down. Do we know what they want? Hmm? Um, Instagram is. Let me get it up. Yeah, I just probably got better than I can Instagram. Instagram is the Fit Brick and the Rhino Clubs. Okay. Mm -hmm. And I think we're to now Peter Kerr. Ah. So those two prizes are going to be sent direct by Richard Fitz Fitzgerald and. Right. So what you'll do is we'll contact, you, we'll we'll reach out for you, uh, Peter. You message us your details and your shirt size, and then we'll um, we'll take care of the rest. Yep. Are you ready for the YouTube one? Yes. So do you want to get catch on the comments first? I have. All right. What, uh, what's, what's that? It? Welcome back. Yeah. Haven't forgotten about the extra boys. I don't know. I don't know what that means. Congrats to tell me about rookies. Cheers, your girlfriend. <laughs> Cheers, walk back to 999. Hi, guys. Uh, great to see you in the live video. Hope you've had a good week. Yes, thanks, Philip. Right, so oh, we'll just read Lemons first. Third member of the crew seems to be a lot more photogenic than the first two. <laughs> she's only bricks, too. She probably can, <laughs> actually. She probably could, yeah. Well, she's Swedish, so she's got that building in her jeans. Mm, built in. So, number seven, we've got 75 viewers, uh, not viewers, uh, entries for the YouTube giveaway. Mm -hmm. Drum roll, everybody. Oh, drum roll. Number one. Number one. Ooh. John Buist. <gasps> Is it? Yeah. Hey. So, congratulations, John Buist. You have won. I forgot what the prizes were now. You've won the Brickies Buddy in the M Store. PPA um, PP stuff. Mm -hmm. And obviously another shirt as well. So again, we'll eat Plus so a few miscellaneous bits that will be And miscellaneous bits that will get thrown in, yeah. yeah. So the winners will tag on our Instagram and we'll mention on the YouTube community. Mm -hmm. We'll either reach out to you if we can, or if not, you reach out to Dad on email or Instagram DMs. Emails in the description of every video. Emails in the description, but if you've got Instagram, just hit us up in the DMs with your address and your uh, shirt size. And then we'll uh, get it sorted. And you've got, did we say a week? Yes. You've got a week to do this, or we'll, re we'll have to redo the raffle. Mm. There you go. Well done, everyone. Thanks yeah, for congratulations. congratulations. Gareth's, uh, Gareth's disappointed. Sorry, Gareth. <laughs> Sorry, Gareth. <laughs> maybe maybe we get it 50,000. Gary <laughs> Ross has Hermes. <laughs> Steve, how did we enter? Uh, we, had, we had posts up to. Um, uh, and that the obviously it closed today, but the post was again what Nia designed. The posts were the rules, and then you just had to enter on the Instagram or community. Yes, it's oh, sorry, John, John, John Booth is in. Oh yes. Oh, congratulations! So congratulations, John. If you so contact Dad by email or Instagram, whichever is easier for you. Make sure your address and your shirt size, so we can get a mm. get one of these orders for you. Yeah. So congratulations, John. Uh, oh Ian, I said you could have some new strong boys, but I haven't used, you, but I haven't used on your last live chat. I tell you what, then Ian, um, send me an email, in the emails in the description of every video again, and then um, we'll get in touch and we'll sort that out. I'll come and I'll buy those off you definitely. We're in the market for some strong boys. I'm sick of having them, although I do like Hodgson's and still need to get some of our own. Yeah. Ozzy, great gesture with the giveaways, keep up the great content, it was nice meeting Linnea, she seems like a lovely lady. Ah, oh, thank you. Oh, that she is. <laughs> she is. Thank you very much, Ozzy. Um, Steve, 20k, oh. Um, unfortunately, the raffle's closed now, Steve. <laughs> <laughs> Better late than ever. Oh. oh, but I'll leave the names on just in case um, that Peter doesn't get in touch. Yes. I think, I think John's going to be on it. You better yeah. check me out today, that's right. Yeah. When is Facebook mainly, but... Uh, Dominic, you need to speak to um, 
Richard or Charlie about that. I think they're just um, prototypes at the moment. Thank you. Yeah, Gary, congratulations, everybody. Yeah, congratulations. Second that. Celebrate the biscuit. <laughs> You got a really lovely community. John said, "Where's your email?" So it won't be, it won't be in this one, but in um, any, any of our any of our previous videos, they'll be on there. The only ones they're not on is this live and um, the announcement that me and yeah. you made yesterday. It's in the oh, description, what? isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Main, the mainstream videos uh, emails there. I think Dad's gonna write it down for you. How do we enter? You can't enter anymore, Steve, unfortunately. They give, uh, they, it ended today. Yeah, hopefully there'll be a new one in the future. Hopefully, yeah. <laughs> Maybe if we get to 50,000, we'll do a big giveaway. Hint, hint. <laughs> Gareth's been here for a while, and I'll be I'll be here till after 100k. Might right, win John. something one day. Who's the other one? Who's the other one? Uh, Peter. Peter Kerr. If you're in Peter, I'm not sure about John. If you get, <clears throat> I, I don't know if that's coming out backwards or not. Nope, there it is. That's good. Oh cool. Oh, best thing is, Kennedy.Steven with a V, 130 at gmail.com. And if you're struggling, just re-watch the video and pause it. Hmm. Oh, too late to enter. Sorry, Steve. They, if, if we get another one in the future, we'll be sure to wear. Uh, Spread the word, get people to subscribe, when we get to 50,000 we'll do another one. Yeah. It's great to see down to earth people like yourself, says Ian. Thank you, Ian. Thanks, Ian. Oof, right, what do we do now? Right. We've, we've done the air. Done the kind of uh, happened very quickly. Mm -hmm. we've, we've got any fake confessions? Still is, you want people? Fake It was fun to watch, says uh, Hans. Thank you, Hans. Ah. <laughs> Thank you. I thought I was like, I reckon I had Bracker since his game yeah. tag, isn't it? <laughs> right, we might as well fire us some questions then. Mm-hmm. Brick lane related. Or cosplay related. Mm, so we so already seen me on WhatsApp about that. Oh. So he stopped talking about cosplay related to Brick Lane <laughs> channel. Oh. You've been warned. <clears throat> I say. Story Steve. <laughs> Hi Alfie. Hello. Hello Alfie. Oh yes, please, thank you, buddy. Steve and Val, well done folks, love the channel. Thank you, Steve. Oh, sorry, Sean. <coughs> Got the wrong glasses on. Mind building looping, eight hey lads. Eight hey up guys, how are you? Well done on 20k. Thanks very Thank much. Thank you very much. Cheers guys, absolutely delighted everyone. Great to be part of the channel's community. Cheers John. You're welcome. Thanks for entering. Thanks for being part of the community. Definitely. How many years in the game? Sago. Um how many years have you had in the game? 36. 36. Yeah. Um, I think it's my seventh year. Mm -hmm. Wow. Near, uh, near a few months. <laughs> <laughs> Philip Jeffries, this is an easy one. What's your favourite job over the last six months and why? Go on. Well, I think that's easy to say. The A&E job, the uh, big, the big, big extension. Which uh, which took us th three months. Three and a half months. Three and a half months. Now there's a wall as well though. We weren't that slow. Yeah, the, the wall wall wasn't as fun as the extension, but the extension was nice. Yeah. And obviously that was fun because it was a big project, new um, new things that we had to do, and obviously working with the A and E lads that was always a nice treat. Um, a picture of it. There you go. There's a picture of the front of the extension. Brickly, oh, Sarah's, uh, Sarah's poking the bear. There you go. English Bond. That's just the front. And those door openings are 10 feet high. So it's bigger than you think. I've got, I've got actually, you were on that picture then. Sarah's uh, poking the bear. <laughs> she said, Brick Lane question, when are we building Mummy Porch? Oof. Hard hitting question. Yeah. There's a picture of the ceiling. That's a lantern in the middle. And there's actually two lanterns going in it. Um, yeah. Then why don't you like site work? That's how high the ceilings are. <laughs> Sorry, I did enjoy that job. I just thought it should be. Yeah, you made it. Me too. Um, why don't you like site work? Is it because it's so slap dash brushing all the time? 
That's partly to do with it. Yeah, but it's not, is it? You can't rush because you, you, you've got no gear. Yeah. yeah. You've got no brakes, you've got to wait for this. The, the, the sounds broke down, the machine's got to pump shit. And the one that we were in particular, it was the workers were very toxic to you. They would, they, they'd be next to your face and stab you in the back, which is exactly what they did when they saw And we were like, we were bottom of the food chain. We were there for a year. Yeah. yeah. And we did one house from the Two ground. Two half houses. One, one house from the ground up, which is on this estate. Yeah. And then two half houses. half houses. We only did one full. We get given all the shit that if some if some have been sacked or left, we get given yeah. crap. And then when we were promised stuff, we got stolen. Yeah. So we we're our, we're our own bosses now, which and we're, we're with people who are nicer to us. Yeah. People who make us bruise, not a. Uh, yeah. And like I say, we've just had that three and a half months for Tony and the Amy lads, and that was just like a breath of fresh air. Yeah. Absolutely Don't, loved it. Dominic asks, have we tried the superior levels? No. Is that a brand or is that? Yeah. All right. I like handmade. Ah, I see. Uh, why did you use bricklaying as a trade, Steve? There you go, there's your fun question. <laughs> My chat's not working. Oh, there you go. He didn't choose bricklaying. <laughs> no, I chose um, engineering. Um, left school, let's go to Preston College to do BTEC in engineering or go to the YTS down the road and get paid £28 a week. So I went for the money. And uh, to be a joiner, when I got there, they said there's no joiner places left, so you're going to have to go over there and be a bit there. So that's how that's how it happened. That's how the legacy started. No fancy long family history of Britain. <laughs> <laughs> um, Steve, you're a grafter, you will never, re uh, you will never retire. <laughs> Sean. <laughs> And John, always loved your videos, guys. Down to earth grafters and a great standard of work. Oh, Thanks, thank John. That's, that's, that's what we aim to do, just show. Build it like it's for you now. Yeah. Mm. I build it like it's my own. Sarah, wish you had built my house. <laughs> tell you what, it, 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 it'd be a lot better, I'll tell you that much. That's, that's, uh, I've been given the option to have it or show that I'm going to show it. Sagu says, love the bloopers. We know they're all in. <laughs> <laughs> And that's not my editing, they're all in. Mm-hmm. Here's some good ones. Site works is full of house bashes and arseholes. <laughs> not being on many sites, thankfully, but every time I've been, there's no one I mean what there's no one I mean no one really gives a flying F about what they're doing. Exactly. Mm -hmm. The gr w one of the many ground worker firms on this uh, on this site, one of the like the boss of them was just Drinking like a, a box of cans <laughs> in, in the middle of the day, so that shows the uh, that shows the work ethic. Mm. That's so quiet. Was, yeah, <laughs> your question was answered. <laughs> hey, oh. Hey, we've not mentioned the uh, site name yet, Mum. <laughs> right. Anyone else got some questions for us? What have we got? Um, what have we got coming up? Um, I'm an appointed job at the moment, solo, obviously. Um, um, Stuart, even if you actually give away your t shirt as well, don't need to sign your t shirt. Thank you, Stuart. Cheers, Stuart. There's a little it's lady asleep there. So what's your next big what's project? What's the next big project? Um, um, extension. Yeah, we've got a few extensions coming up. The biggest extension. Um, we've, got, we've got a few extensions coming up, actually. Uh, lot, we've done a lot of lintels lately. We've got a few more of them coming up. Uh, price defence job. Um, Nice. Just loads of stuff really. Just catching, catching, yeah. catching up really. We've got we've got a lot of lintels done. Like we well, did four different houses, didn't we, on the trot? Yeah. We've got it's, a few like them dusted off. Yeah, there's plenty of videos in the can ready yeah. for me to get them actually edited. And we've still got some A and E videos left or? Uh yeah, two. Alright. Yeah. 
so we've still got plenty in the, in the backups. Um, keep up the videos, says Sagu, thank you very much. Warp Factor, wish you were on mm -hmm. my side of the pond, lots of projects here. We will we'll be staying in for a few weeks and we won't be working. Sam O'Connor says hi chaps, and hi, great Sam. channel, thank you very much Sam. Uh, Marin Building and Roofing, would you consider working in sunny Sheffield? We've got a pair of semis that we are putting a lot of conversions from. On from hip to gable on both. Yeah, we would be going over there, but uh, Mark Hep's over that way. So, see if Mark Hep's still in the chat. Um, <laughs> Hans wants a hug. Hans wants a hug. <laughs> I'll, give you a, I'll give you a Hans style hug. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, someone's got a cosplay question. Apologising. Oh, sorry, Mum. Daniel, um, do you think that the Welsh Comic Con should be renamed now that it's moved to Telford? Um, I suppose so. I don't know where Telford is. Me neither. <laughs> What's that one? <laughs> I mean, if it's changed location, it probably makes sense to change the, the name. I think. Sounds about right, right? Mm -hmm. If it's in a different place, change the name. Yeah. Gareth, the, uh, the fixed bit clamps, does, um, the only down thing about them, which is nothing, is sometimes the spring falls off. You just put the spring back on because the spring isn't actually attached. It's just hooked over. But that's about it. Sometimes, sometimes you catch Jeff Guard and you get sore thumbnails. <laughs> but um, no, they, they, they're fantastic. There's nothing you can fault about them fits bricks. They're worth every penny. They're so versatile. So many different things you can use them for. I know, but the main, obviously, you've got the, use them as the clamps, but you can use them as a tingle as well. And you can also put them on a horizontal, we've used them on a fence job, stuck them on top of the fence post because it's a 100 mil post. They're brilliant, absolutely brilliant, well worth the investment. So, where we are, Gareth, did you just read? Yeah, Stuart. Stuart <laughs> finished their bottle at the moment, falling asleep, not falling asleep, however. Um, Sam, Steve, how did you get into the game? And Alex, do you have any brick lane qualifications or are you self taught? Um, I've, I did my two years at college. And I got my I got MVQ, wasn't it? Yeah. Got my MVQ. I did all the health and safety tests and everything. So you got CITV or the City and Guild? It was one of those two. Yeah. I can't even remember because I did the test and never got the card. Remember, I still got this. To this day, I never got a card, no. even though I took the test. No, that's a CSCS. That's nothing to do with qualifications. Oh, it's, oh right. That's just that stupid card that the. Oh. It's a money making racket. That. Well, I did a CSCS test, but I um, did my two years with an apprentice under the apprenticeship. Um, thing. Yeah, you did a proper apprenticeship. Yeah, so I'm properly qualified. I've got the certificate up there somewhere. Yeah. It's collecting dust somewhere. So how did you get into the game? You actually, you, by accident? By accident, yeah. yeah. You're supposed to be a joiner on the white youth training scheme. Telford is near Wolverhampton, so it's not in Wales. Well, that's definitely not a Welsh Comic Con, then, definitely, it? definitely change it then, it's yeah. It's a bit up the road, isn't it? Yeah. John, love the lentil job. Do you ever think you have finally seen all problems with lentils and trays? Must be getting near, but if every time we, we do one, it's, diff it's just flabbergasted. Sometimes there's no lentils, sometimes it's like just just a county tray. Yeah. Dixie, absolutely. Couldn't agree with you more, mate. That's exactly what it is. Yes, yes, it's a cash cow. Well, yeah, well, I did that test. Never got any cards. Never been asked for it. No, never. Mm -hmm. It's like a card to say that like you're qualified to work on site. Yeah. That yeah. Cost you 20, 30 or quid for the test. And you have to pay for the car. To like, do the test, I had to prove that I was qualified for it later. So I had to pay for a, pay for a, um, a search. So I paid for the search. Then they found out that I was qualified. So I had to pay for a certificate, which I'd already, obviously, I've never had since 1988. So it cost me, I think it cost me nearly £100 in the end. Oof. And then got asked for the card once. God. The only good thing was it was a gold card. <laughs> now, now I'll never be asked for it again. No. No, that's true. Knock on wood. Yeah. Mm. Uh, ben, have you seen the new trial magnets that Charlie's put? Yes, yeah, in them. Is that like the small one? The little tiny thing, yeah, it goes in your belt. Right, well, mm. that's cool. Ian, do you have any holidays planned? Go on. Absolutely. Go on. Tell them where it is. We've done our little couple of nights at Alton Towers and then it's the big F. Someone died there this week. What? In Florida? No, the new drop tower. Yeah. 14 year old kid fell off it and died. Oof. Oh, well, you've convinced me to go on, haven't you? Yeah. I think I'll be going on that. Absolutely time. not. <laughs> and obviously, I've got plans to go to uh, Sweden in the summer. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
So we'll either, we'll either be going to the Comic Con or um or just going to Listerberg. The Swedish amusement park. Me and Christine are going there eventually. Definitely going to Listerberg. Mm. And then definitely going to go to New York next year, hopefully. So they've got, look, there's plans in the brewing. Um, if you could create your own theme park as with Fit Ralph, uh, at any cost, what would it be based on and what would you call it? No, that's not a crap question. That's quite cool, actually, Ralph. Mm. I don't really know what to call it. I'll have to think about that one. Mm-hmm. But I'd take the best roller coaster out of each park and clone it. Um, th- theme parks with Stephen Alex. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Remember Nemesis right in the middle was a centerpiece. Mm. I'd I'd have like a horror themed amusement park with like with like Me too. like Nemesis like some of the rides like monsters and such. Yeah. Halloween park. Yeah. Yeah. All year round. Definitely. Plenty of screaming. Oh yeah. Um. All of this is brilliant. Oh no. Um. Dixie said they wonder why we can't get young lads on site. Exactly. Mm. Well, hopefully. Yeah. Uh, Maybe sometime this year in the summer, there might be something that could help with that. Yes. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Um, Oliver Franklin, love you guys. Brilliant watching you. Thank you, Oliver. Thanks, Oliver. Um, Ash, my volume is on max, but you're still quiet. Is anyone experiencing the same? Gareth mm-hmm. says no. Could, could just. We have this a few times. Some people message in. It could, might just be like your connection or something. Or because mm. I think we've got everything. I think we set everything up right. Yeah, Dixie, exactly the same as me, mate. Let's go back to the archives, go and qualifications and the gold card. Ridiculous. Yeah. Daniel, do you have any stonework? Oh, no. Dry stonework. Oh, do you do any? No. That's 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 not um that's not really bricklaying that, that's proper dry stone wall into his skill himself. Oh, look at this. Sean, did my manual handling and safe pass in Ireland yesterday, two hundred and fifty. <sighs> Bloody hell. Jesus. That's in a, is, do they have different currency to us? 250 euros. Euros. Yeah. It's a lot of money. Yeah. William, Alex, do you enjoy being a bricker with your dad? And does your bricklaying business, is it a father and son? It doesn't say father. A oh, father. Oh, <laughs> that too. <laughs> I feel the like gun pressed in my side. It's great to work does with your bricklaying <laughs> business. Is it a father and son? Yeah, it's just us, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, just us, father and son. With, the, with a temp with, 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 yeah. inter- with an intern yeah but uh, no I enjoyed working for him yeah because uh, I wanted to be I wanted to work with him for ages but at first he didn't want me to work for him he kind of pushed me away <laughs> no I want to be an electrician or a plumber so he's not governed by the weather a job where I can kill somebody <laughs> or myself <laughs> thoughts on Ben for Mixer Lister Diesel if it's clean yeah looked after they tend to be bell with a um, What's the, um, I can't remember what it's called. The engine, I don't know what the game is called. Anyway, it'll come back to me. Um, mm. how, no, sorry Mark, you didn't win anything. <laughs> You've got enough tools anyway you've been spending lately. Someone wants in it, um, some brickwork on lock and raise in Sheffield if you're interested. What's that see? Mr. Wisdom. There we go. Yeah, everything well done. I always sit very well. I think just. Where are we at? Where do you see yourselves in five years' time? Um, Pretty much where we are now, isn't it? Yeah. Hopefully, a few more subscribers. I've lost a lot of hair. Don't borrow mine. Don't count on it. I'll say that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> said hi to Mark. Mark well, said hi to Mum. Gareth. Steve Pashlow. <laughs> Mark, Mark has moved next time. Yeah, Mark. It's going to be 50k next time. Because it does take a lot to organise these giveaways. I mean, you, it costs a fortune when you buy these t shirts as well. I'm paying for them too. Mm. Absolutely able. Do I give up my IT job of five years and become a bricking? I get so bored spinning in my chair all day in the office. Uh, be prepared to not earn very much money while you get trained up. That's the only thing. Um, you've got to be, uh, you can't just jump in onto bricklayer's wages, you've got to basically be apprentice wages. 
you've got to work your way up. Mm. But in terms of like whether you'll enjoy it or not, if you get if you get oh my god I can't talk. If you get find the right kind of work to do with the right kind of people, you'll find it's very enjoyable. Yeah. Because like in in some jobs can obviously be a bit of a nightmare as all of them can but some jobs can be very therapeutic I find yeah because like even Rob said that he said like he said if he could he'd tell his doctor if you've got anyone with any stress send him to work with me send him to work with him yeah because he said once he picks that job all his all his just all his troubles just disappear when you're bricklaying a nice straightforward wall or something you can just switch your mind off and just yeah lose yourself in the uh, in the work which is always quite nice yeah so you've been looking for a hog carrier for a while. Preston area, always get lads with no CSCS or don't drive. Don't understand why young lads don't drive. Have a go. Have a go. One is brilliant at the moment. Yeah. Hmm? Young lads that don't drive. I'm, wor I'm, <laughs> I'm working on it. <laughs> Have you ever had a massive argument at work and fall out over it? Um. No, well, our arguments we fizzle out. We yeah. fizzle out because it's a very awkward journey home if we don't <laughs> fizzle it out. Especially if we were at Poulton or something and I was drive yeah. with that tension. Yeah. Obviously, we, we bicker every now and then as as all families do, but like we always saw each other. You never have an argument? No, knock on wood. Um, you know, big cash cow scam is electrical pack testing. Yeah, that's another one. Like, started out doing plastering and block work and ended up doing carpentry. <coughs> You just never know what's for you until you try it. And mind you, they, they all come in handy if you just love doing extensions and renovation. Yeah, yeah. true, Mike. And that's another thing. <coughs> that links into the announcement that's coming up soon as well. Yeah. So just keep your eyes posted. For, keep, posted keep your eyes peeled for that one. Ian, what's the best brick lane job you've done so far? I think in terms of showing what we can do, I think the A&E job. Yeah, I've yeah. been doing Brick Lane 36 years and I've never enjoyed working because it wasn't just the job, it was the people. The people actually made it. it acts, what a bunch of lads they were. Yeah. They were just so great to work with, every one of them. And obviously, in terms of the brickwork, we got to do massive scale English bond with white cement, which really looked nice. White lime cement, water. lime water. Mm -hmm. That looked really nice. Yeah. And that's all thanks to Tony giving us the opportunity. And that's all through YouTube. We'd never have met him, it wasn't for YouTube. <laughs> we could just go to the bottom. We're interrupting Liam's gaming time. <laughs> <laughs> Talk of the devil, that's one of the boys. It's Friday, Liam, all the raids and all that are over, aren't they? On uh, Destiny. If I can remember right. Server. I think Tuesday's the reset day for a raid. Oh no, it's uh, Trials today, I think, isn't it, Liam? Does um, your dad pay you top dollar? He... No, not yet. <laughs> He, he Once he starts earning top dollar, he's getting paid top dollar. Hey, I earn top dollar. Liam, all right, lads. Hi, Liam. I think there's going to be a big argument <laughs> to know, actually. You've, you've, you've jinxed us, pal. <laughs> hi, Liam. We've just been talking about you lot. <clears throat> you said hi to Izzy. Oh, hi, Izzy. And uh, Bob the Bill. And Bob, Bob, the Bill the Bob, Bob the Bricky. Hey, you guys. <laughs> His uh, pro pocket just slumped <laughs> from the goonies. <laughs> Liam, yes, it's sweaty. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, I remember. Liam, it's it's not these two picked the uh, tonight for the live stream. Nothing to do with me, mate. And it, hey, Liam, how's it going at the um, at the job? We're waiting for someone to send us some pictures. That's true. Yeah, I see what's well. going on. I see the other lads have started a new job. In my opinion, house builders now treat lads like rubbish, but expect them to bend over backwards and meet them. I tell you what, Dix, it's as if you've been working with us, because that's exactly how we feel about it. Exactly. Liam says hi to you, by the way, love you. Hi. Liam's, Liam's our bricklaying pallet. Ah. He was our uh, labourer slash bricklayer in training. Yeah, and anything heavy we needed lifting, mm. Liam did heavy lifting. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's going up the I'll send you some nice one, Liam. Nice one, Liam. Good weather as well, that helps. Ian, do you normally work weekends or try to keep it five days? Where's that? Oh. Ian, yeah, just under. Uh, I used to work weekends all the time, but to be honest, since we started YouTube, it's took the pressure off and I actually enjoy a lot more time off than I used to. I'm working tomorrow, but I'm off Sunday. I've got a road trip to Birmingham on Sunday. Well, things we can't mention because Mum will tell us off. <laughs> 
<coughs> Brick Jackets is in. And Moon Man Guitar. Hi, Moon Man Guitar. Hi, Brick Jackets. Glad you could join us. Tom Carpenter. Great time working. How... How, how do you pronounce this, Lovey? Hmm? <laughs> uh, oh, Helsing Boy. That place? Yes. <laughs> in the early 90s, wonderf wonderful people to Swedish. They are basically the same as... Northerners? Northerners. I think Don't you say all the nicest things, you know? They're a bit, really friendly, they're a bit friendly than Northerners. Uh, when I was at the security coming home from Sweden, I had a uh, security member apologise to me because she spoke in Swedish. <laughs> what? <laughs> Izzy, I couldn't believe that today. I left the chat, the, the social group chat, and Izzy sent me a message says everything okay because she left the chat. I said, oh, I, just, I thought I could just slip away and not notice. And somebody's added me back into it. It, pop, it pops up when someone leaves the chat. Yeah, I'm sorry, sorry I left the chat, but obviously I'm back in it again. <laughs> I was, yeah, because I'm I, trying to get off Instagram. I saw a message for uh, Brooklyn Social Club after you asked if you're right too. Yeah, yeah. I didn't see that one. Oh my god. Oh. I, I'm. I need. I need to get. get stop the oh, distractions. Saying that, I'm not against notified all the time. Mm -hmm. Um. Absolutely mm -hmm. able. Thanks for your comments. I'm currently renovating my house and trying as much DIY as I can. Wonder if I could learn more and do a trade full time. God, I hate IT, but at least it's warm and dry. Mm -hmm. You've definitely got that for you. Yeah. <clears throat> and then, as, as well, I suppose working IT, you've got a job for life. But doing a with a trade, you've got a job for life as well. It's like you got two two strings to your bow then. Yeah. Yeah. You can always. You can, Go and do something else over the winter when it's too cold. Well, hey, hey, you could you could bloody market himself great as a bricklayer if he's an IT guy. Hey, if he's an IT guy as well, he could market himself brilliantly as a bricklayer. Yeah, get himself all sorted. Been house bashing for twenty years, getting bored of a one side attitude. Yeah, from what I've heard of other lads, it's, it's just it's just going down the pan. Definitely, which hopefully uh, this he's, thing. The, the rates never used to be brilliant, but I used to used to get extra, so you get paid for lentils. Cavity trays, stuff like that. Now they don't want to pay for it. Everything's in the price, they say. Steve, you know, how was Alton Towers, Steve, you're a granddad, you are you? Yeah, I am. She's nine, years, she's nine months old. We're still, I, I we're think still he, means, uh, he means your, phys your physicality. Oh, um, we, me and Chris hobbled round. He's halfway there, Liam. It, we, um, we didn't do much queuing because it's dead quiet, so we got, we got, I think we got about 14 rides in. Got loads of stuff done. Really good day. Nice weather. Bit chilly, but it was good. It was the day. It was the day after opening weekend, so it was absolutely dead. Thought that video I sent yesterday tipped you over the edge, says Izzy. <laughs> well, well, uh, as Dad said a few times, he gets very distracted by his uh, social media and such. So, Izzy, yes, Ricky's buddy, Mr. Jackets. Oh yeah, Rich, Richie's buddy. Where is it? Where is it? Have we missed it. I think it's there he is. There. Hello guys, hope you're well. Hi Bricky's Buddy. Yeah, uh, someone's just won your Bricky's Buddy, so we'll be in touch with his address to send that out to him. Thanks for the... Uh, yeah, thanks, thanks for being for the, part of it. For gifting us the, uh, the Bricky's Buddy to give away. Much appreciated. Tell Carmen to put your prices up yet, asks Del. Yes, actually we have. Ben says get a room. <laughs> <laughs> Mum says uh, you, she didn't hobble around. <laughs> no, you didn't. I did. Every uh, every two hours, it was either ibuprofen or paracetamol just to keep getting me around the place because it, it's a trek and a half round up the house. I think we did eight eight point four miles. But um, love it. Can't wait to go back. Um, going to what Mum said, Sarah's put no. You were dragged. <laughs> um, Brick Jackson says even is he? <laughs> I didn't see what Liam's put. Lovely plenty of rides then, buddy, says Liam. And then Liam says, get Alex on the VR again. Oh, definitely. It was, it was a really good day, Liam. Really enjoyed it. And then uh, we stayed at the Alton Towers Hotel on that night. And then we just spent the day chilling around the hotel. Went for a few, bit of a walk and then came back about tea time, didn't we? Yeah. Just plodded along. Bob and Bricky, what did I win? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Bob. Mike, really enjoy watching you guys at work. You are neat and tidy. I'm retired now, but... Like keeping a hand in. Oh yeah. Thank nice nice you, Mike. It's always nice to do a bit now and again. Have you ever seen your wife? Does she tend to stay away? She's upstairs now. 
She won't come on the video. She, she prefers to be a keyboard warrior. Yeah. Mm. You'll see her in the chat, as in the purple sea, but uh, you won't see her on the videos. She'd rather stay on the videos. Ricky's very soon leave into is he? Is he? Right, we're at past eight o'clock, should we say about half eight, wrap it up? Yeah. Yeah. Just been just over an hour. I'm off from his dying, well done winners and well done to me on t-shirt design. Mm -hmm. Thanks Sarah. Thank you. Thank you Sarah, see you later, good luck with Daisy. Mm -hmm. Have you worked for Red Row? Asked Dixie. No. No. We, we drive past him in Bursco, don't we? Like yeah, I've all the time, yeah. Yeah. There you are, Chris, Chris, <laughs> so Christine, Pe Ben's asking to come and say hello. <laughs> Love to get you. Camera shy, Let's Ben. Let's drag it down. <laughs> nice speaking with you both, got to go. Good to speak to you again, Thanks Liam. Thanks for dropping in, Liam. Nice, oh. nice to see you again. Hope you enjoyed Friday. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look. Thank you. Oh. All right, mate. Some interesting stuff from the boot job in Glasgow. Can't make heads or tails of it, mate. Um. If you're on Instagram, you can direct message into us, or you can email you know, email them, yeah. It just so happens, there's our email address. Excuse my writing. It doesn't look, it doesn't look so bad the writing, does it? It all looks all right. Mm -hmm. Kennedy dot Stephen one thirty at gmail dot com. It's an ad, not a C. Yeah. At. What's the worst house builders you've worked for? Our last company. I want to say the name. My mum will kill me. Mm -mm. I'm gonna say it. Mm -mm. Oh, she's mum's text. <laughs> uh oh, we're let's, in danger. Let's see what she says. <laughs> if we get near to mum's put no. no. <laughs> if we get near to say it, mum will tell her off. Put it this way: we live in one, and our daughter lives in one, and the hallway is about seventy seven mil. foot long from oh. door to opening. And it's 70 mil out. So uh, I think it's about 35, 40 mil out of plumb. Going like that. The building standards, that's a lot. Mm. It's shite. The 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 re the just about borderline reasonable margin is about five millimeters. Yeah. Fifteen is the mo is the biggest. Oh it's fifteen the biggest. That's the biggest tolerance. And seventy. Unless you're in a then zero is the zero tolerance. Zero is the tolerance. <laughs> <laughs> he goes to Christine say hello. <laughs> Looking forward to the next job. Um, there's actually there's there's two two the big square brown brick extension. I've still got to do a video of that because I'm going to go see the customer and film it finished. Um, and we did a little job on that as well. Got two here as well. Ian's asked, "What's the best ratio for mortar?" Um, five one and one, isn't it? Five one and one. We use it. Um, uh, Amy. Amy. They and use then, yellow sand um, with lime. And white cement, and it looks just fantastic stuff. And because we use um, we use bagged sand at home, it's um, four and one, four bags to one cement. Yeah, four bags of sand to one cement, and mm -hmm. then with plasticizer, we don't use lime down here, up here. Um, and then there's another one as well. Bob's and you don't hear a Hoover. That's why it's what you doing upstairs. <laughs> Looking forward to the next job. Uh, I love watching your videos and when you work with time match my missus. That's like all good fast work and it cracks me up. Guessing you're a fan of the Blue Man Group, says. Uh, Absolutely. Mm -hmm. 12 times I've seen them. We even went to Birmingham team, didn't we? Yeah, we did. 2018. Oh, I see them too. Paul Carpenter, new houses have just smashed up and got um, it's godless work nowadays. You've missed a couple out. Would you ever build your own house? Absolutely. We tried to get into this one. Yeah, we tried to go for this company to build our own. Mm -hmm. We didn't quite get it. What's the story with price work in the UK? Is it cuts the bone? Apparently, this, the price is the best best they've ever been. But it's just um, it's just the organisational site. What's she done? It's, oh, the Hoover is done. <laughs> mm -hmm. New houses just smashed up, and it's godless work. You know, definitely done. Yeah. <clears throat> we we work we picked this work because it's it was I think two miles to drive to and a mile and a half to drive home. That's the only thing that kept us there was how close it was. But it was we, we, we just we hated work, didn't we? we hated yeah. Going to work, it was horrible. Paul says four to one. Yeah, four to one standard. 
Probably because she's a good wife. <laughs> Dixie knows the seven cements is cream compared to that silo swap. Oh, definitely. Silo stuff. So you, you get you get on the dry face work and it comes like stood up, and then you get on some wet block work and it comes like soup. So when you um when me and dad do our mix, we mix them by hand. Mm. But on sites they come in big silo. No, like we mix them in the mixer. Yeah, yeah. Or in the uh, what do you call it? Cement blender. Yeah. In the cement oh, blender. Oh, that. That's its new name. So we do it in that. But on site they come in big ready-made silos and it gets mm. like like a big ice cream machine basically. Yeah. And obviously it could be like really not how you want it. Mm -hmm. See you Ben. I'll get it to come silo next time. See you Ben. <laughs> silo swap for wet bricks or oh, definitely not. Which which was a lot the case when we were last night. I oh, better stop before anyone tells me off. The trowel belt. I don't know if you mean the actual tool belt with the trowel holder, but it's the Bricky's Buddy. That's yeah, what we use. Bricky's Buddy is the um, magnet trowel holder. And it's just it's just a, a cheap plano plano um, belt. Yeah, just it clips it, it slides onto any belt. Yeah, we've got um, Stanley pouches, man. Stanley pouches, yeah. And we've yeah. got a uh, is it a plano brick hammer yeah. holder? Yeah, someone knows I've seen about that. Hammer holster. Yeah. Thanks, have a good night Alex, thank you very much. Would Alex like to build his own house? I'd like to build my own house, yeah. A brick house with a log cabin. What? Oh, not a log cabin. <laughs> Be Evil Dead all over again. <laughs> with the pencil. Oh. Silo slop and wet bricks. Oh. We, we, did, we did foundations with silo water. And Jesus, it was awful. Want quality houses, but supply shank materials and slow service. So yeah, sexy. exactly. We read in the uh, video to site fashion. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Well, it's just a thankless job that. But it's one of them as well. That it, at the same time, needs to be done, doesn't it? It does. That, yeah. that, that, that's probably why they know they can get away with it so yeah. much. Yeah. Because it needs Definitely. to be done. Just buddy, cheers, guys. You're welcome, Sam. Let me just try and find that poke picture of our replacements. Or you talk amongst yourselves. So how's the weather going over this week? <laughs> <laughs> In the weather, weather dad annex. Plus that. Ian. Edited up and ready to go. Mine are usually posted the same day of week I film them. Guess it's good to have a few in stock. Well, Del, I, I got up to seven and I'm down to zero. No, I've got two. One is currently with Tony waiting for him to okay it. So we'll have two A and E videos and I'm in the middle of put, um, editing one now. But, um, we're way behind. As you can say, um, I think it's September the last video. I think the closest thing me and Dad had to an argument was in uh, Leamington <laughs> about the upload schedule. Yeah, when I was losing the plot. It, uh, there was a misunderstanding basically because um, Dad Dad said uh, I'd filmed a lot and he was he was gonna have to like um, cut some of it short. But the way he worded it was like I'm axing everything you filmed up until this point. So I went livid with him thinking. You're gonna hack everything I've done. And I, I, I kind of lost the plot with him. And then, um, obviously, uh, once we calmed down and we realised what we were on about, yeah. we sorted that out. Right, here's a picture of this is the gang that replaced us. I don't know if you can get that or not. That's the cavity side. And it's blown in insulation, so obviously that's supposed to be jointed. Or at least flushed up. You should climb up that wall. That's that, that's the the fast you see. Um, Alex House with a dad annex. What's an annex? Like an extension. Ah, I thought it was a buddy sleeping tablet. <laughs> <laughs> Too busy at the minute. Oh, that's a. Massive project. How, how long do you think you're going to be at that house, Marty? Just keep making it bigger. 
and adding bits on. He's done an oak carport, he's done a summer house at the back, and now he's doing a two and a half story extension. Okay, is that the one uh, you showed me? With the 20 cube raft. Yeah. Yeah. Dear. Unbelievable. And it's just the two of them on it in my tin. And he had to battle through with a noisy heater and even a digger. Well, <laughs> struggles that Mark. Yeah, poor Mark. <laughs> Tim stood outside freezing his freezing. <laughs> freezing his conkers. <laughs> I worked for the same house though for 20 years, used to get looked after, but we got treated like shite, so jump ship. Didn't even get an apology. Well. <laughs> uh, I've worked for a conservatory firm for 14 years. And I left there, never got a thank you or a good look. Okay. What? For 40 years? 14. I well, said 40, I was going to say, you've only been working 36. <laughs> and then I worked for the um, Groundworks firm for 10 years, same again. Never, never, they never even came to see us on the last day. Never, never got a text message to say thank you. No, nothing, good luck, nothing. So it means nothing. Doesn't matter how hard you work for somebody. Can you get a watch for uh, the conservatory? Uh, I've got a 10 year watch, yeah. A watch. Yeah. I think they got it out of those gr another grab machines. <laughs> Let's got looking at grab machine. If we were to build our dream house, which location would you choose? Mm, Leamington Spa. Mm. Uh, a long way from any neighbours out in the open. Yeah, I was going to say, I agree. But not too much so Christine would be scared. Mm. So I'd say, like how you have yours. Mm. Like a 10 minute walk to the neighbours. Yeah, mm. and the occasional loose stuff in the garden. Oh, God, no. <laughs> Dixie, um, the brick layers are just treated with contempt. One of the one of the lads complained about um, they changed the scaffold, and the complaint says, "Well, if you don't like it, you can f off and work somewhere else." That was the that's the attitude. And this guy was a bricklayer as well, this builder's manager, so he should know first hand. Uh, building and roof scene, roofing, seen some shocking stuff when I was on site. Proper depressing when you take pride in your work. Definitely, mm. I think w w one one like soul crushing time, the cobble. Oh yeah, we oh we we'd never done co I still haven't done cobbles. Dad handled the cobbles, and um, one of the cobbles we just finished, and then uh, one of the joiners came up to like start looking at the roof. The foreman joiner. The foreman joiner. The main man. He stood on the cobble and knocked the whole thing down. He climbed up it. Just as I'd finished it. Gone. And you don't get paid to rebuild it. It's like, just get it built. Just so, that's another two hours out of your time. We both just died inside when that happened. Like you say, thankless and unforgiving. And we did um, one with a... Uh, like a purling steel on it. With a... What's it called? Dormer roof. So we had to put the steel in, wall plate at lower level, then wall plate on the steel. And the joint came up to me and he said, That is the first house I've ever done where I could cut all the spars the same and the all fit on the same. He said, You're the, That's the first one ever. I thought, Well, if, if that's shocking, if you can't just get a steel in parallel, that's not good. Bill, greetings from Nebraska, USA. I love your great work. Thank Hi, you very Bill. much, Bill. Thanks for tuning in. Quite early for them, then, relatively. Mm. Not really. I'm just eating. Two. 20 past Evening. three. Evening. Mm. Yeah. Five hours behind. Could be six, Nebraska. Could be, yeah. Still got 70 on it. Yeah, you've got nothing better to do. <laughs> Uh, what, else, what, else, what other news have we got? We have some new equipment. Yeah, we've been we spending. We've, we've been spending, yeah. Mm -hmm. We've been using our using the YouTube money for some luxuries. Yes. Worked on times ten price 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 job in sites, three seal award sites for the same house builders. They aren't bothered about our pride and skill, says Dixie. They, 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 do you know what? They never are. We, when we did the foundations, we had a lot of comments off um, build inspectors, the NHBC, saying how good our foundations were. And then there'd be a visit coming up one of these frigging award things, and the the, uh, the, the agent came up to us and said, uh, just make sure you bang, you bang on for this one. Make sure it just do that extra bit. So, like, why? 
but, but what we do is good as it is. So why should we go that extra mile just for you to get an award? For them to get a pay rise. Because they get the award, they get the they get the uh, the bonus. The actual trades people who have won that award get absolutely nothing. Nothing. You're lucky if you get a breakfast out of this. Yeah. Yeah. No thanks. Lawrence says welcome to, to this video. Is that mm -hmm. me? <laughs> welcome to the to this ah. video. <laughs> Got pulled on a tie wire day three millimetres out. My god. Do you know what? Saying about my daughter's house being like forty mil out of plumbing, seventy mil out of square. We had the NHBC come up to do his inspection and while we're working he walked in front of us, picked my level up and put it on the wall in front of me. Thought what you cheeky get. Thought you take that level to my daughter's house and put it in her hall that you've passed off for a CML. And they never inspected the skin work, they just focused on the internal work mm. on the other side. Like the part which never gets seen and which never gets bothered with, that's the part they were bothered about. Yeah. Josh says, Josh S just says, just bash him up, exactly. Yeah, that's the plan, just bash him up. Dell's off, I'm off now guys, great job on the live videos and hope we can catch up with soon to talk about the YouTube now, awesome, Tony and Steve Mal. Have a great weekend, cheers. Yeah, man, see, we'll you, see you, Del. See you soonish. Thanks for coming in. Thanks, Del. Plus private customers appreciate a decent job on my site, but that's it. Definitely, yeah. yeah. Even so, uh, the client of the A&E, &E, our Charles, the client, mm. he's seen how much he appreciated yeah. the brickwork, yeah. which we've never had like that before. I've never had someone shake my hand and say, I'll, I'll treasure this brickwork for the rest of my life. It's like, give me a lump in my throat, I wasn't expecting that. I know, yeah. And as we were leaving, he said he was so thankful for his staying on and such. Yeah, properly appreciated it. Yeah. Hey, it's uh, Will. Hey. How's it going? All right, Will. Uh, how long have we been on? And an hour and 78 minutes. An hour and a bit. Never, you're never late, Will. You're always welcome. You're Will one of them. <laughs> it's not bloody, it's not real blood, by the way, Will. It's fake. <laughs> Will is another AE lad. Top geezer. He's the one Alex was doing shots with on the on the night out. Yeah. Oh, that Will. That's Will. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, Will's like the one who greeted you on the phone. Oh, I like him. <laughs> Everybody likes Will. Oh, yeah. Will we'll give us one of these back. <laughs> <laughs> have to do a proper one soon, Will, in person. Yes. Big hugs. You get good, you get good hugs at A&E. Oh, yeah. And good breakfasts. Yeah. Oh, the bacon sandwich. <laughs> Good night, folks. So, Sean, see you later, Sean. Thanks for stopping in. There he is. <laughs> Anyone who watches AE &E will know Will. He's a super duper roofer. Alex's buddy. Did you enjoy that bit of roofing you did with AE &E on that flat roof? That's Mark. It was fun. Yeah. And obviously, when you're with the right company, it was fun. Yeah. Having a bit of a buggy on the roof. Yeah. I'm trying to, I was trying to find that video actually. Shane, where's Alex's girlfriend's accent from? It's from Norway. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse you? Oh, no. It's a Swedish accent. There you go, there's Alex up on the roof with Will and Brian. Another string to his bow, a bit of roofing. <laughs> there you go, there's Will. Doing the old resi tricks on the roof. As you can see, the roof is massive. That was our last day, wasn't it? One of them, yeah. Yeah. That's the really good project, you blast me downstairs. Last few days we did, we were on the roof, yeah, because the brick the brickwork kind of stalled because we were at the end of it. It was waiting for the roof. Waiting for the roof, yeah. yeah so couldn't finish the brickwork until the roof was done. So we came onto the roof. Yeah. Sure, glad you didn't say Russian. <laughs> <laughs> She'd have a hard time getting back home if that was the case. Kirby to Kirby, oi oi. Oi oi. Can't wait to see you lads, can't wait to see you too, Will, hopefully soon. Yes. Which we'll be able to talk about soon. Hey Will. Oh god. We're in Birmingham tomorrow. That's my brother. So um come up to the NEC and we'll, we'll meet you at the NEC. Taking no sorry, Sunday. Sunday, yeah. Sunday we're up at the NEC. Mm -hmm. Taking these two to the, the um Megacon. Megacon, yeah. Yeah. So we'll be we'll be down your end. Oh, 
five, uh, 25 past. Can you count in the time down? Oh. In the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> Got my daughter next to me, she's laughing her head off, forcing them. <laughs> <laughs> um, PayPal? Is the real one? Well, I haven't got any money. Drama. Do you have a password? Yeah. Do you have a face ID or? I don't know. Face ID, I think. Do you want to log yourself in? <laughs> That's ridiculous. Also, say hello to your daughter, Will. Um, of course, Will is safe. Of course, Will is safe. That's for all you Rufus will hate. <laughs> you going through? No. Oh, stretching. Have you logged in? No. I don't know what the password is. I'll keep you suspense. What's your I'm so surprised. You don't know your password. Yeah, I do. No. Thank you very much. <laughs> Back in day. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Night, lovely pictures, Will, in um, Jepsum Gardens, is it? That's where my announced went there last weekend. Beautiful place, that. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Yeah, really nice. Any update on how Rodian's doing? Um. Not good at the moment. Holly's had to go back to have more chemo, I think. Or is it radiotherapy? I'm not sure which one it is, but um, things are a bit rough at the moment. But um, if you follow Holly on Instagram, she keeps it keeps everyone updated on She's Instagram. She's really good with keeping her updates. Yeah, Rodin's, Rodin's busy looking after Holly, basically, so yeah. you don't see much of Rodin at the moment, but he's there. I'm off guys, see you on the next one, well done on 10k. Thank, Thank you very much, Marin building and roofing, cheers. And there you go, people are wrapping up for us. Yeah. Oh well, oh. I'm I don't know where we're going to Essex tomorrow for Mother's Day, have a great day and I'll be keeping a look out for the photos of you on Instagram. Oh, well, they'll be there. Oh, they'll be there. We'll, These we'll, two are dressing up together. We'll have, oh, yeah. we'll have some up tonight probably, actually. Yeah. Mm, maybe, yeah. Yeah. Throw some of the ones we took today. Mm-hmm. Oh, uh, talking of Essex, well, um, me and this one, when are we going? July, the day before the big thing. Prodigy. What, it's in Essex? No, but that's where the Prodigy from. Oh, I was like, when you talk about Essex, <laughs> I was like, yeah, pro- to Essex. Prodigy tickets, well, we're going to see them at Liverpool University? I think so, yeah. yeah. In July, so I'm looking forward to that. I'll do a lot. I'll do an Instagram live for you so you can watch. <laughs> I think uh, Mother's Day, I'm uh, taking Mum and Sarah out for a late dinner. Mm. I can't quite go to Essex. No. <laughs> You'd be taking Mum out for lunch in Birmingham. Yeah. I'll be treating her. Yeah. So Mother's Day on Sunday here. Oh, right. This Sunday. Mm-hmm. Oh, nice. Been hijacked by Mega Con. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so if anyone's got any last minute questions, yep. throw them in. We're gonna last, 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 last questions here before we wrap up. We're, we're gonna, gonna start, an hour and a half. We're gonna start wrapping up and then get the details up on our Instagram and YouTube for the giveaways. For the winners. Better check your email, see if uh, John's messaged you already. <laughs> Those three emails. Yeah, because at least with um, the other one, Peter, we can tag him on Instagram. Oh, get rid of that then. Someone wants five dollars off me for what? <laughs> Very suspicious looking name too. Mm. Clear I'd say. It's getting clear. Someone How's has, that come through on PayPal though? Probably, probably, it's probably like with Instagram where they just type in Pay now. You just type in so many names and like My God. Yeah, let's get rid of it. Yeah, we're teaching that. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's gone quiet, so I think we'll wrap it up then. Yeah, so, um, yeah, so obviously, John, if you check it out, he's not there. Oh, not yet, yeah. Needs to do a competition with just me on. <laughs> Who's that? No, <laughs> yeah. the, the, Mark, the Mark competition. Anyone, <laughs> everyone named Mark in our uh, in our subscriber base enter. We can't call him Mark here anymore, can we? Because that name's been hijacked. Yeah. But um, yeah, so we'll do a quick wrap up now. So again, congratulations to the winners, John mm-hmm. and Peter. Um, once again, just contact Dad on Instagram or email, whichever is easier, with your 
Yeah, with your t-shirt, don't we? Yeah, with your dress and your shirt size, so we can yeah. order the right shirt size for you. And then we'll get them sent off as soon as we can. Keep you in a correction. Correction? Keep you in the loop. The loop. Keep you in the loop of how the orders are coming and such. And for everybody else, thank you for entering. Thank Most you all for watching. Yeah. Nice. And thanks to the companies for participating in this mm. giveaway. Yeah, yeah, thank you very much. Love you guys. Congratulations on Tony Cray. Thank you, Will. Love you too. Thank you, Will. So, yeah, so thank you to everybody for watching the live and for all, all for subscribing. Let's roll on to 50k. Yes. So, we will see, see you on Monday for the for the video, for the video premiere. Yes, I haven't set that up yet, but I'll be setting that up soon. Yep, video premiere on Monday as always. So, we'll see you all there. Thank you all very much for watching. Yeah. And oh, Rob's just come in. What? <laughs> Rob's just come oh, in. No. Oh, no. <laughs> we're, we're just wrapping up, Rob. <laughs> Oh, Rob. Oh, sorry, Rob. We'll, we'll catch us in the next one. Drop us a message, Rob. We'll have a chat with you there. See you later, lads. Lads and lionesses.